Ew. Top pref. Am I actually gonna be forced to play it? If you want mid, you can have it. Thank you, bro. Appreciate it. Vlad AD carry? Yeah, Vlad AD carry is fine. Any AP carry ball wins fine. Shit, one sec. Let's do that. 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 And that page, this thing will change itself in a second there. Not taking domination second anymore. Well, look at this matchup and that matchup. Domination second doesn't give me enough to consider like taking it here. I would rather have the ability to kite with the uh, Nimbus. It depends on the matchup. Every single thing you do in the game, when it comes to items, runes, playstyle, summoner spells, has to do based on what champion matchup you're going against, what your win conditions are. How, how you can exploit the game. Is it better to do it one way or the other? So, you can't just go domination every game. Watch every Nico mid swap. That'd be better for our team, at least. I know this this champion is more of like a, like a poking assassin, right? Cool thing is I'm going to be able to control most of the match for my Viego. Can her dogs go past the uh, the minions? No, right? So I'm not going to hard shove this yet. Because I want to I want to make sure I can see what play my jungler wants to go for before I start doing anything. Wow. Well, that was kind of fucked up, that Maokai gank. That was a very early... It's okay, it's not a big deal. I still have the priority in the lane that I want. I can still help out. Yeah, the Kha'Zix just killed himself there, I think. So, and now I'm gonna actually shove all the time. Until I see that my uh, my jungler wants to go back. Keep the wave going in the middle, and then I can keep doing rotations too. No play to be made yet for a bit. We're gonna go playing, we're gonna play for the grubs here. So this time, I'm actually gonna push the other way, but slowly. Like, I'm just gonna wait. I'm not gonna do it very quickly because I wanna time the I wanna time the pressure. I wanna time the pressure with uh him going for the grubs. <clears throat> Here we go. Now we shove because he's going into the, the zone where I actually have to help him. See now the big the big wave is coming in. I can actually help him just fine here. Oh, maybe not, I guess. Hopefully, Sion gets a kill here at least. Okay, I got one. Do this for City R boots. How did TM out? Damn, the Nico's actually. She was really, really strong there. Also, the the dynamic of how I'm supposed to trade it there is a little awkward. Could have gone for the Kha'Zix, I guess. He was kind of a little bit out of my range, though. It's okay, I can still help this guy. From true conviction, radiant. Oh. Thank you. RBC did not post today. Yeah, no, he was busy today. He couldn't. That's okay. We give him. We give him a little break. You know, one day, just for one day. Damn, he's holding the way for her just fine there. Huh? <clears throat> I'm not gonna reset and get my item by him because I think I can. I'm still gonna have to make a play in the next like wave crash. Just because of the way that I see the Viego's pathing a little bit. You guys, you guys, uh... Actually, I should probably put the map cover on, I just realized.
And now we reset. He was off trolling to the sub room. Okay, I'll stay. Just to make sure. She didn't get it. Okay, now we're done. Yeah, let's go back to mid lane. Having that constant like wave priority to be able to move first like the entire game is actually so strong in solo queue. I go completed boots most of the time. I prioritize that over a completed item. Well, I, I completed, com you know, full item. First item spike, you should always prioritize that. But if you can't quite get there, I prioritize boots. Because it helps me with rotations to fix like teammate mistakes. He doesn't have a play to make there. Oh. This guy is griefing pretty hard with the constant roams. That support knows how to roam, but doesn't know when to roam. No profane? We could do profane this game. The life seal doesn't really matter too much, so I might keep the Warhammer just for Eclipse after. Being able to hover here first is the plan. Okay, I killed them. They have no jungle for objective now. <clears throat> we win. Good win. Hmm, maybe not. That's a shame because um Honestly? That was really that was pretty well played by them. But that was a complete one for one. The Kha'Zix suicided for me. Just so they could get that battle going. Kha'Zix is here, I might die, so let's see. Yeah, not real. This Maokai is permanently being a nuisance. If I leave lane now, she gets the tower, I can't do that. Nico is so fucking cancer. <laughs> Her E lasts 3.5 seconds. That's so insane to me. But she killed herself, I think. Wow. But then we kill ourselves back. Okay. One black cleaver this game. I think I can kill anyone in side lane for now, or even like 1v2s and all that. It just depends on how the fight actually starts. That flash secures us the dragon, so it's worth using there. That the Ash actually feels so fucking worthless. It's crazy how it could be 4v5, just because we have Ash as a champion. It makes everything so much more difficult. I am too low, so I'm just gonna keep pushing. I guess even getting a 4v5 won't secure us objectives. I have to kill like three people by myself this game. Hmm. He fucking got one tap, huh? Damn, they actually got Baron, three people, and then they're getting 2v1 mid lane? Hmm, be a little hard. Maybe. Oh my god. <laughs> Where did my HP go? I just fucking sh got shredded. Everyone. 
this fight at least. If we don't win? Really? Where 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 was our damage? Well, I'm confused. Two of them died. Or got pushed out. We can't win 4v2? Well, that's kind of shitty. Very unfortunate way of the game ending. Well, <clears throat> bit of a team diff. Little bit of a team diff, little bit of a team diff. Quite unfortunate. Sunder Sky not good that game. Dude, fucking got himself in, a, in, a, in an item slot. It wouldn't have been good that game with uh, the four of them. We will no longer be supporting Microsoft Windows operating systems. 7, 8, 8.1 for all League of Legends and Teamfight Tactic games. Please see our... I assume that... Is that the date too where they're putting Vanguard? Nice. Nice, nice, nice. 